Welcome back, everyone. In case you forgot what day it is, which I doubt many people did, it <laughs> is, of course, Valentine's Day, the day of love. And what says love? more than these beautiful flowers. Yeah, and if you forgot it's Valentine's Day, you're welcome for the reminder, yes, men. Yes, of course. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Hannah is here from Bloom Chocolate Flowers, and you are going to show us how to maybe jazz up some floral arrangements, but also talking about maybe some of the things you have to offer today. Okay. So thanks so much for coming in, and where you're do welcome. we even begin with these arrangements? Well, for the latecomers, today is late, actually. <laughs> <laughs> we have hand tides in the store that are like this. They're all hand tied. They're wrapped, carried out. So uh, those are ready to go. Someone ready can walk to go in today and, and say, "I just need right." A and bouquet. you see, there's a little string around here. You drop it in your vase. If it's too tall like this, I would cut it down an mm -hmm. inch. Mm -hmm. But it's ready. It doesn't need any arrangements. And these very, are very beautiful simple. Beautiful flowers. What kinds of flowers are these? So there's roses. There are just as general daisies, alstroemerias. Uh, wax flower out of uh, Fallbrook, California, wow. in the hills. And let's talk about these roses because we're in the middle of winter. These mm -hmm. are probably not from around here. No, let's they're talk about not. Uh, these roses are from Ecuador in the middle of the world, um, the mm -hmm. e equator. Incredible. And they come to us directly from the farm, FedEx. Really? Wow. Every That's Friday. That's amazing. Ah. It is amazing. And they yes. smell wonderful. They, they have look a wonderful. Yeah, they're sustainably grown and, you know, the workers are paid the right, the mm -hmm. right uh, wage. Right. Oh, we yes. like that. Yes. Well, yes. let's talk about if uh, and, and you maybe want to put together your own arrangement today. So maybe the, you the, the pick other up thing? something from yeah. the store. How so, do you do it? So if you get someone that picked up a bunch of flowers at the grocery store and just to put it in a vase, that's really not looked that well. Mm -hmm. So if you have nothing else to add, I would suggest cut it down, make it short, like in a if a short vase or. Um, can you do even like any decorative bowl or something around a the bowl, house? A bowl, anything. Mm -hmm. And start low. Start with greens. And this is something you can do if you need to go pick up a bottle of wine or champagne right. yeah, at the grocery right, store. And you're right. just picking up a few flowers. This makes it special because you're going that little extra effort, right? Exactly. And <laughs> like here, I have a hyacinth that was flown in from Holland. Wow. Oh, that's beautiful. It's beautiful. So you can add so that. So you're just in. trimming those down. You're just taking off, you know, the, the, the loose foliage. edges, the yes. foliage. Right. And then the other thing too, with these short ones, sometimes you get a rose in a bouquet and it breaks. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Well, a short vase. Here, you, the major thing is to cut cut the flowers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is there a trick to? It's I've heard yes. cutting them diagonally? at an angle. Okay. Yes, that's because what you should be doing. That's what you should be doing. Where's my knife? I brought a knife. Um, because a straight, it's not drinking water this way, you oh, see? Okay. And at an angle, the water still is able to get in there. And the best thing is we have a knife. Oh, wow. a little trick for you at home. The other thing about tulips is tulips grow. Mm -hmm. Once they're cut, they still grow. Okay. Oh, okay. So if you have a, an arrangement with tulips in it, pretty soon the tulips are gonna be taller than the rest of the arrangement. And that's not that they're dying or d droopy. They need to be cut down because oh. they gr their stem actually grows. Wow. So that's something to keep in yeah. mind. If you're trying to make the little extra special bouquet, make it really sing and on Valentine's Day. it's easy to do. You can do it yourself mm -hmm. or you can head in to Bloom and get mm -hmm. it ready for you. Do you guys also have the, the vases available? We have the vases available. We have a large variety of roses. Delivery, I don't know how many deliveries we have left, right. but you can always pick up. Mm -hmm. And uh, the other thing you can do, you can go to our website and order pickup. Okay. And Great. the best thing is either order the roses or designer choice, because so you get something rather than nothing. Great. And what's and that and website? Pick up. It is chocolates-flowers.com. It's and plural. And where is your brick and mortar? Where can people go the in to see River you? Park Square, second mm -hmm. level next to Athleta. All right, and there's that information on your screen. You got the uh, phone number there and uh, where you can find them. Of course, Valentine's Day, as you mentioned, there are still flowers available. If you head yes. in now yes. and you last minute maybe forgot That's about the beautiful. flowers. And then we have these. Lots, yeah. you know, we've made those up fresh, just ready to go. Right. There you go. Johanna, thank you so much for coming in on, I'm sure, what is a very busy day yeah. Yeah. Thank you for so your much. store. Thank you. 718, nice. now you're watching Creme 2 Morning News on the CW.